All right, let's finish this up. So we just spend the rest of this on the oil shale and then we'll head out. Can't forget the yucca fruit as well. Gotta start gathering more of that. Okay, there we go. We're done. Let's just put these into stacks. So we got about... Actually, a full stack of stacks. And then, yeah, for both the stone and the oil shale. Alright, let's get out of here. And then we got some sand as well, and more clay soil. Alright, let's get out of here. Start harvesting some yucca fruit. Right. Or can we use the machete? Yes, we can! Just use the chainsaw. Uh, I'm thinking we go through here and then we head north. I think this is going to be quite a hassle. What if the Yuka is even worth it? Because thinking like we got. A whole bunch- we're getting a whole bunch of mineral water from this. Like from the goldenrod and the red flowers, I think we're gonna get a lot of water just from that, so probably don't need the smoothies at this point, but 
But at least take some just for that variety here. Just bring a full stack with us. We've got a hundred three. Okay, there we go, full stack. Let's get out of here. So I'm thinking of going to this town over here and then heading north. Let's we'll see where it takes us. Or you know what? There's a POI here. This will lead us to the road. Mima residence. Okay, so the road is here. Is it just going to take us into this town? Oh, no. It's going this way. Well, at the very least, we got some nice flat terrain. And then we'll just follow these roads until we get into town, and then we'll head north from there. Where are we? Or maybe we can avoid that town altogether if it doesn't take us there. Oh jeez, that... Don't want to fall down there. Now, while well, we've been out here, had a whole bunch of things firing up, smelting down all of the stone and the iron. And I've also made a whole bunch of iron bars. Like, I do need to put those down as well. We got a bigger side road going north. You know, I should really try out those rural POIs, because they do seem interesting. They go, like, down quite a bit, I believe. And here we go, main road. How did I get here originally? Like, I need you to load in. Well, either way, I'm moving north.
Maybe pass by this trader wrecked. I like how everything is still loading in. Okay, so we'll cut through here and cut through here. And then Trader Wrecked will be right over here. So I'm going to check the vending machines once again for rock busters. I can't... There we go. Just one though. Holy shit. What's the matter? Can't find what you're looking for. Uh... Huh. I want the food stuffs. Corn, coffee, yucca. I guess I'll also buy food. And that's Be pretty much careful it. Careful out there. You wouldn't want to get hurt. Oh no. Don't want to get hurt. I'm slow as fuck. Come on. All right, so let's get out of here. So we travel through this road, but you know what? I kind of feel like taking a shortcut, so let's go through here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure like I went through here at some point. Oh yeah, this is uh, when I first got the bicycle. That's how I found Trader Jen. So I went through that path. So for the rest of the day, I'm just going to stay back at base and just build it up. I still need to install those iron bars all around the roof of my home. And I did build a built like a bunch of wooden spikes, but never really used them. So I probably should set them up. Uh, Arbor Loop Rest Area. Now, even though I don't really loot those anymore, I do like those Tier 0 POIs. They at least populate it with stuff that makes sense for the world. Like that rest stop in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. It's pretty neat. Even though I haven't really taken a good look at it. Okay, we're going trade direct here. I don't think we need anything from our forest base here, so I'm not gonna pass by there. Uh, maybe I can get that airdrop. Why not? Since it's all on the way. Alright, get your ass in here. Alright, two rockbusters. And hey, what do you got for it? Can I allow What's it gonna be, huh? And then we'll buy your food. Oh, perception mod. Yeah, I'll take Nothing another perception fun. mod. Deal's done. Now beat it. That way fucker. I can just put it in my different armor sets just so that 
I'll always have that perception mod in there, no matter which armor I'm wearing. Because keep in mind, if I wear an armor set without the perception mod, I'm only going to have 9 out of 10, which disables some of my damage for the spear and the sniper rifle. So it's really important that I have that perception mod in my helmet. It basically saves me three perk points. Alright, so we got Magnum Ammo, Jar of Honey, Painkillers. Ammo Crafting Bundle. Okay. So we'll deal with all of that once we get back to base. What's, what's going on over here? Body bag pit. Huh. Alright. Good source of nitrate, I guess, and bones. But don't really need them at this point. Maybe later. Wait, but that doesn't even have a road going to it. My inventory is almost full. So I also need to start crafting some more of those, uh, what is it called? The pocket mods, just so I can put them in the different armor sets. That way I don't have to deal with this problem. And of course, if I see any dire wolves or zombie bears here, I am so taking it out. I do need the loot. Well, don't need it strictly, but I could sure use it. That's a dead bear. I passed by this earlier. I knew it was dead. Just go around here. Oh, there's a zombie bear. Wait, is that a zombie bear? I don't see glowing eyes. Let's get your loot. Really? No, I'm just gonna chainsaw you. Wait, seriously? Dude. Seriously. So I got XP from killing the dead body. Well, alright. I can put stuff in here still. I'm also going to need some sewing kits. Because I did use up a lot of them for the armor. Also, at some point, I do need to get those treasure chests that I... Oh, uh, God. It's, I have, like, five treasure maps, like, right... Or six treasure maps, like, right here. Like, I should spend, like, a day just digging them up.
Okay, we're almost there. Now, if we need more rocks, I can always get it from this hole that I dug to the left of me. It's really nothing but stone and stone. I didn't find any resources there. Anyway, here we are. Let's get back in here. Get this all sorted out. I guess I should put these back on. That probably would have helped since I wasn't mining anymore. Actually, not probably. That would have helped. Okay, so let's let's also get some coal in here. Take back this blue. And we'll just let that go. Now, how are we doing over here? Oh, you're going to need some more iron, which I have. Okay, before anything else, let's put away our mining set here. Perception, perception. The farmer hat needs this perception mod. It also needs a, a helmet flashlight just for good measure, but otherwise it doesn't really need anything else. I guess a double pocket mod. We can put that in here. Anyway, let's just continue doing this. Like, we just have a lot of ammo at this point. So, gotta remember to use it. It will. You know what? Let's just put it in here. Just so it's less confusing for us. Now let's open this up. And we got ammo making stuff. Okay, we got the yucca fruit in here. Yeah, and the only purpose for this is... Well, yucca juice and the yucca juice smoothies. So that's an option if I want to do that. i start making more concrete here. You know what, maybe we should make some concrete blocks. Just so we can convert them into concrete, like, right away. And then we'll fill this up with even more rocks. Oh. That's why it's not going.
All right, let's get our stuff. I think we should just put this blueberry pie in here. And then these things we can sell. The motor tool parts, like I do need to upgrade the chainsaw at some point. So just put them here. I still need to sort this out, so. How do I do this? I feel like I should have a lane of storage back here as well. Wait. We just make a whole bunch. And then we'll store it in the wood storage thing. There we go. So these things can now be harvested. Oh yeah, we also need farming blocks. Uh, recipes. And track that. And then clay soil. Where it's in here. So we'll make like however many We don't need to use that much nitrate. So we just craft this. This will take 15 minutes. Let's craft it in here. Which would Never mind. So this is already crafting concrete. So I guess we'll craft it in our inventory here. Do I really need another 8x scope? This has... Yeah, this is an 8x scope. Now, for the Horde Knight, I want to use this sniper rifle here. Or maybe I can just swap this out. Because this doesn't have all the mods. Yeah, we'll swap it out later on. Just not now. Oh, and speaking of that, uh, wanted to do this. Yeah, 15% damage to iron. Since I'm mainly, uh, disassembling iron-related stuff, I might as well, right? Then we'll put storage down here. For like miscellaneous stuff. So ammo. Uh. Yeah, our excess ammo can be stored in here. Or better yet. Nine mm ammo. This will be shotgun shells. Seven point six two ammo. And this will be uh yeah, Magnum ammo. And then this way we can like sort this stuff out. 
Probably should extend some lights over here as well. Okay, so 7.62. Shotgun shells. No. 9mm. Magnum ammo. That way we're organizing this stuff. I'll just continue organizing this stuff. And then we can reserve that for, like, ammo-making uh, things. We got a lot of 9mm ammo, so I'm probably going to have to upgrade these things. And then we can just store our AP ammo goes here. Just put that in there. There we go. I do have an MG here. That'll be in reserve. And then we can sell these. And you know what? At this point in time, how about we start upgrading our stuff here? you making these ingots. Let's just upgrade everything. Don't know what I'll be using these for, but it's there if I need it. And then this storage was supposed to be temporary, but... Well, I'll just do this. So we are low on shotgun shells. Lots of 7.62 ammo at this point. Lots of magnum ammo. Ooh, maybe we can turn this into electrical. And then we can just bring those in here. I think that's all for electrical. Oh, shotgun turret bundle, dart trap bundle. These bundles. Mo making... There is our ammo making supplies. Okay, so we'll put our electrical stuff here. Now the car parts go here. Oh, we still have oil shale. That's where we put the oil shale, in car parts. Well, we're... Uh, you, you know what? Yeah, just put the oil shale here. And then we'll sort out the rest of his stuff. We need to scrap this.
This sniper rifle, this, and this. Selling these things. There we go. And then sell these things. I probably should open these up at this point. Yeah, the SMG auto turret should actually be over here in electrical. Trigger plate. And then this ammo. Here we go. from the other side here. Okay, dart traps put in here. Those aren't dart traps. I'm gonna cancel this first and then do this. You probably should put the water in here. Oh, we got spaghetti. It's 122. It's a bit more filling than the gumbo stew, but the gumbo stew also gives water. So most of the day I spent preparing for this horde was really just spent, like, organizing this inventory here. Uh, what the hell. And then we'll put our storages over here. Uh... I guess we'll start putting our farming blocks. I do want another row, like, right here. We're probably not gonna have all the seeds to completely support this. Anyway. this in here. Weapon parts and we need to put away the snow. Okay, do we have any medicine that's related to farming? Like, is there anything related to farming here? Uh, probably not. So all we have at this point in time is the crop harvest bonus 100% and seed harvest bonus of 20 so this should theoretically give us 3 per punch or 5 10 15 20 or wait did I read that wrong crop harvest bonus so it gives us 100% extra crops now I understand Oh my god, that's actually really good. Okay, 
Okay, so let's deposit all of that in here. Okay, so we got pumpkin seeds. We'll plant that. I'm just gonna plant the rest of these seeds. Get down the pumpkins first. Okay, next, let's do super corn. Next, we'll do blueberries again. Uh, we'll do mushrooms. Goldenrod. I guess, uh, more coffee. Put down more of these blocks here. Like, we just need one more. Do potatoes. And then we can cancel this because I don't think we need any more farming blocks at this point. Uh, let's do. Let's do yucca. So that was good. Why is everything so dim? Like the power should still be good. It's, what the hell does it matter with you? Uh, you know what? One thing I want to do is set up turrets. I did this wrong. Also need to replace this with the quality six. There we go. We got a scavenger set, a farming set, mining set, full quality. And then some miscellaneous stuff. Okay, what was I... Repair kits. Bring these out with us. You know, we can put away the mineral water at this point. Uh, I do need to repair, like, everything here. So we'll need these bars, hatches we don't need. Steel cubes. Okay, we have that option, but do this. Get some concrete. And then our upgrading thing. Take these things. You know what, let's do some extra steel here. Okay, let's get these corners set up first. And then we'll put down these iron bars.
That way I don't accidentally fall off here. If I'm on the roof and I have to fight here. Iron bars take a long time to make, though. So that's pretty much why I'm pre-making them. But I think I have, like, way too many of them. At least for now. Maybe I'll make a second layer. But for now, let's just do one. And then we can just put this away now. At this point in time, um, go out here. Oh, pff, I need cobblestone. Don't need that much. Like at some point, I'm going to be upgrading this to steel. That's why I'm making so many steel ingots. And that is it. I could also put down these concrete blocks. How many do we have here? Let's make another 100 since they do take a long time to make. Just upgrade the front here. Now, I'm going to move this motorcycle out of the way because this is pretty much the kill zone here. And is this empty? Yes. At this point, I do need to prepare, so... Uh, keep the, co the concrete here. Cement... I'll just keep two stacks of this. Stack of this. Uh, we'll keep this in our hot bar. Okay, so we'll do painkillers. Do a couple of vitamins, recog if we need it. And grandpa's learning elixir. And some extra meds just in case. Wart bites. Might need it. Uh, you know what? Mineral water as well. Okay, we are good to go. You know what? I'll just take this real quick. Okay, close this up. All 
All right, let's do this. Oh, I forgot. Reflex sight. Yeah, this is so much better. Yeah, I don't like the scope on this at this such short range. It basically means I could use this rifle a lot more. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do not come in here. Wait a minute, you, you've already gotten through this? What the hell? What the hell? Uh, this might be a problem. They already got through my hatches. Unfortunately, I couldn't get the turrets up in time. Probably should use the fort bites right now. Recog. Grandpa's learning elixir. And then some coffee. This stays repaired and this stays loaded. Okay, I need to check this now. Where are you, birds? Real quick, can I get this? No. Oh, jeez. Come on. Every time I reload, I should just repair this thing. I'm 
shotgun works a lot quicker. to absolutely clear this quickly. I just use a shotgun. Let's get the birds. Am I switching to the repair tool uh, before I finish the reload? I think that's why I'm reloading right after I switch back. Jeez, that was close. That's a dire wolf. do that.
Oh, now I have an infection. Wait, I did not take these vitamins. Oopsie. get a snack real quick if you don't mind uh see a shepherd's pie in front of you how about that also take a recog and a mineral water It's already 2.30. Ow. Fucking hell. Quick repair. That's a lot of irradiated. Okay, you need to repair now. Just going through your head without doing any damage, or what? There we go. Okay, this is almost over. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Don't go through the damn thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back off, man. Don't be crawling through that hole.
Okay, 30 more minutes, and then we're done. This is actually going really well, except I lost, like, two of those hatches early on. Not sure how. Okay, we're almost done here. Getting a lot of XP from this. Oh my god. What the hell, dude? Survive 10 blood moons. Hang on, how many blood moons did I do? Like I said, survive 10 blood moons, but I don't think I did 10. I think this is 8. Yeah, sometimes 8 equals 56. Like, there's no way I did 10 blood moons. So, I'm not sure what that was counting, but anyway, we're done here.